Max, what's your topic today? <gasps> Surprise! Um, yeah, we don't know. We, we, like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. I got you, boys. Good. Uh, he, so, got, he did it. He pranked my dad. <laughs> so theoretically, in the future, if you had the intention to become parents, or unintentioned, but it so in the not way, too distant future, next Sunday AD, where you have to have a nuclear family. Um, so say you have a kid, and you eventually yourself want to get them into video games, and you want them to love them as much as you did. Mm. How would you start them out? So we've had this topic before. Oh, we damn it! Yeah, this is the problem with surprise uh, with me. <laughs> well, this is a this is a. I was actually scrolling through the topics like uh, like a couple of days ago, and I remember passing through that topic. Eating like, ass, good, yes, eating ass, possibly. Well, I don't know what your guys' responses were. So if you want to reiterate, so yeah, let, let, let's do a redux because that was a topic where Ricky was the one of the co-hosts, and so man, I can just bring back all my old topics. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Porn. We, we have, uh, <laughs> just porn kills love. <laughs> um, well, we'll go into this one a little bit because you, know, you weren't around for when that topic was a thing. So I wasn't born yet. You weren't born yet. Uh, we we <laughs> created you in a lab uh, specifically to replace Ricky. Yeah. Wait, why didn't we just make another Ricky? Uh, shit. Damn it. <laughs> you guys got some Asian genes in the yeah. tube. Uh, shit, man. You just got swerved. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what games would uh, you introduce to your... So, my first question, how old? Uh, that's uh, nothing good. Two. I throw a controller at him, tell him to go at it. <laughs> Get good. Throw a uh, controller. Only game I have left is Bloodborne. Good luck. <laughs> Here's an N64 controller. Here's WWF No Mercy. Uh, um, probably... That's another thing you can name this episode. Henry keeps talking about WWF No Mercy. <laughs> that's just going to be called Fuck WWF No Mercy. <laughs> I might start him out with um, honestly some portable titles like from the DS. Okay, but, You know, like again, the PSP. What age? What age? Maybe five to seven. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Nothing so, too intense. So, so you're 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 thinking DS era. What what game specifically are you thinking? Uh, well, let's see. With the 3DS, mm, well, the old like if you want to go like old DS Lite when they turn it sleeker, uh, maybe that version of Mario 64. And if they want something, no, like, that, you know, that so that you can play as Yoshi. Of it's it's terrible, but it's like, just Super like Super Mario 64 does not hold up uh, to this but day. But it's still fun. But that. DS fucking game is you an can, You start it's, out as Yosh. It's yeah, bad, no, yeah, bad. but the <laughs> thing is, is my kid isn't going to be able to gauge quality of video games just yet. That'll just, come at a later time. I love Mario. Yeah, sure you do. He's going he, to play this fucking DS game, and he's going to go back to the N64 version. He's like, I like the DS one better. Why does your child have kid. tiny hands? <laughs> is he Modoc? <laughs> Is he Modoc? Kill me, Simon! <laughs> Father, I don't, me. Father, I don't want to play video games. I want to kill! No, baby Modoc. <laughs> Basket case. <laughs> no! Uh, Geo, dude, no! I know, I'm so doing you're the thinking rest of, of this starting them out with like more modern systems. Yeah, and then eventually when they get older, I'd be like, hey, maybe play some shooter co-op with me. I'd like maybe have him go through the whole... Kick his fucking ass at Call of Duty Black Ops. Or her. I don't... I don't... Uh... We're not sexist. I cook both <laughs> your asses. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... I, you know, maybe have them play through all um, Halo 1 through 3 with me. Mm -hmm. I would make sure they would know that 4 and 5 never, and 6 would never would happen. <laughs> it goes unos, dos, tres, catorce! <laughs> <laughs> um... So you would you start out more modern? I think that's interesting. I uh, start with Adventure Island. We uh, we uh, <laughs> we talked hilarious. about this before, and I've said this before. Where I would actually start them out with more classic games. I, I would actually like. War from I, I, would, I would have them start off with like really simple things. Like I started out with. Like uh, I remember one of the first like systems like I owned so, like on my own wasn't really like it was like back then. I guess like uh, you know you have the NES Mini now. It was like. Um, it was like a fuck, but I don't know. But it, it was like an arcade game that you plug into your TV and you oh, plug, plug and play. Yeah, it was like a <laughs> plug and play, so you could play like Pac Man, Dig Dug. This um, one, Spider Man, just points at your dick. Yeah. Um, <laughs> oh, the actual like the legit plug and play, not like those weird, creepy rip off. The Shrek. Yeah, ones. no, like there's a we had a, like a legit plug and play. Um, I had an Atari one. And so, like, I would get them into to Pac Man and Dig Dug just so, so they could like under and also like Pong and shit. And uh, what's the uh, what's the old school like sort of um, jungle game? Pitfall. Pitfall. 
Like get pitfall. him to play some uh, adventure, some tank battle tank. Battle tank. I would bore combat. That's the name of it. <laughs> I was planning on boring my kid with like nice graphics, so then eventually, maybe at like a uh, early high school age, he'd be like, "Wait, these all look nice, but where's the substance?" And then I no. bust out the good well, stuff. Well, no, see, <laughs> here's the, but, but <laughs> if the mistake you would make is if they, if you, you know, if you start them out with graphics, that's when you confuse them in thinking like. That's what makes a game is graphics and story. But when you start them out with like old school games where all it is is gameplay and then you build off of that, like the game industry build off of that, that's like I think that's like sort of the correct way. And when you go up to the nuts. Yeah, exactly. Again, like we've said this before, where it's like um, it's like learning another language of like learning. Oh, I can play the witness. (laughs) <laughs> uh, make them play the witness while they learn chinese <laughs> here learn two languages for a price of one one of these is useful <laughs> shut the fuck up and game bro <laughs> bro <laughs> uh and then you build off of that right um like i honestly like the i think the pinnacle games that i would not let them get past until they beat would probably be um dad i want to go to school <laughs> Not yet. Uh, Super Mario Brothers. Um, Super Mario Bro. I would Bro. probably also say <laughs> like, Mia. like games like Pitfall and and whatnot, and have them Sonic 3D Blast. No, um, <laughs> and then get into Sonic like, Black Knight. and then get them into like simple stories and whatnot. And then like go into to Chrono Trigger. Immediately have them play Final Fantasy VI. <laughs> no, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a gap in between. So like maybe I will have them start off with classic titles and mm-hmm. uh, right after Earthworm Jim, it's Dark Souls time. <laughs> oh, dude, Earthworm Jim, that's another <laughs> fuck yes. I'm just gonna put him in this. I'm gonna put him in Bane's prison. Nah, yeah, make him TV. play booger, man. Uh, <laughs> and here, then, game hard, bro. And so then you introduce like sort of like simple, like complex stories uh, when, uh, for the time. But when you look back on them now, it's like, oh yeah, like that's sort of like the the building block of what games are now. So like you go to Chrono Trigger, going to like Final Fantasy yeah. uh, six, um, six yes. Revolution X, the Aerosmith like gun shooter. <laughs> yes and and the then build one. off of that and then like go into like more like fun games like uh you know like i would sort of have them travel through like my history of games right uh, i think yeah. uh, like yeah. dad you're tasting games suck <laughs> why do i have to be in donkey kong 64 <laughs> <laughs> um i wouldn't make him beat donkey kong 64 because i never like truly beat donkey kong 64 when dad i, was, I like, hate a pop kid. punk <laughs> fuck you son um shake him and then uh, uh, I would yeah, have him go into like me. I'd have him go into like fun little stories like uh, like Tony Hawk's Underground and then Tony Hawk's Underground. 2. Oh yes, the best story in all of gaming. Yes, exactly. This is uh, the first Underground game. They're Behind not like the... they're not like good stories by any, but they're like fun. Like uh, they they give like at least like a little purpose the little less like arcadey feel of Tony Hawk and whatnot. Only behind the storyline in WWE 12 where. Triple H calls someone on the phone and they're right next to him and pile drive him into the ground. And that's the entire scene. You were doing the Kubrick stare for a little bit. <laughs> and then, oh, like, uh, then bring him into dick. the modern games we have now, right? Like, uh, I would definitely, like, the Arkham games, like Batman Arkham Asylum. Like, I dropped out of. I, I told <laughs> Dad, the story. I hate Batman. <sighs> then I kill my child. Um, Dad, can we buy Star Fox Zero? Then I Can we play Superman sixty <laughs> four. Um, yes, my son. kid sucks. <laughs> Why does my kid suck so hard? Because I like playing your kid. <laughs> um, Dad, can we get WWF No Mercy? <laughs> buy my kid a justice. Teach him how to play the worst character Bane, and he'd be like, Dad, I want to play Green Lantern. Yeah, you don't know to be a man. Henry. You got to stop kicking the. I can't help that I have long legs, long sub. Just, don't, just fucking stop. Just, just sexual. So, I don't know. Uh, so I, that's how sort of like I would take my kids through it, right? Like I that. would take them through the history of video gaming, sort of how my dad took me through the history of uh, of rock and roll. You know, that's why like I, I grew up like appreciating. Um, like uh, artists like Elizabeth Cotton and like <coughs> Lead Belly, and then slowly integrating into like uh, the Beatles Captain and, and Smash uh, Mouth and Smash Mouth and Bob Dylan and whatnot, Captain so. Beefheart. Uh, Jack sort of, blues. sort of going through the history of gaming, like w- w- with the my squid. kid, uh, Henry. How would how would you do it? Start him off with C, man. Let him go from there. <laughs> <laughs> Le- Leonard Nimoy's your dad now. <laughs> what is your name? <laughs> you really are an idiot, aren't you? <laughs> 
That's the only thing I get. Dad, can we play Uncharted 4? No! It's the best Uncharted game. <laughs> it's the best game Naughty Dog has ever made. My cat sucks. <laughs> uh, like, I'd probably start him off with some old school stuff. Like, Adventure Island. Mm, yeah. Like uh, a lot of like good like uh, like point and click adventures as well. Mm. Uh, King's yeah, Quest. my house. My I have no mouth and I must scream. <laughs> Perfect game for kids. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, um, hate. Let me tell you about hate. <laughs> Hatred. Hate. Hate. Dad, can we play Simpsons Road Rage? Hate. <laughs> we play Crazy Taxi like a real family. <laughs> Crazy Taxi. Here we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's Ooh. the plot to Crazy Taxi. <laughs> uh, at the ripe age of 10, I will have my kid play Metal Gear Solid 4. Mm, mm. Without any of the others. <laughs> Just like, you're going to have to no go. Context. You're going to have to go through this hour-long cutscene without any context. You don't know who the Patriots are? Well, Too bad. Can we play it ever, Metal Gear Solid? Yeah, here's Peace Walker, you <laughs> asshole. <laughs> no, they no Dad, go, I want a good game. <laughs> they will go through three first. So then they understand fully, as none of their original fans got to. Dad, can we play Tony Hawk's Underground? I really like the kiss stage. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that that was a thing where, like, yeah, there's a complete was. level where you're just at a kiss concert? Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Dad, where's mom? <laughs> <laughs> You'll get her back when you beat Bloodborne, son. <laughs> get good. There's the cleric beast. <laughs> <laughs> no, not even cleric beast. Ebriennes is your mom Dad, now. <laughs> she was the meals we haven't eaten in two weeks i know son <laughs> <laughs> i'll get you your slim jim if you find another lamp you need to i make my kid beat the sonic the hedgehog port for the game boy advance oh that sounded like dishonored the hedgehog for a second <laughs> you mean <No>. shadow <laughs> where's that fucking fourth chaos emerald <laughs> uh, so yeah that's just how we would do it okay exactly like that <laughs> I'm hungry Dad Why are Uncle Henry and Uncle Max Always here with their kids And why do we all sound the same For all the cats the hose again <laughs> <laughs> Like it's just gonna be like My favorite game is Dead Rising Cause when I watch him eat It's like I'm eating I really do. <laughs> My favorite game is Manhunt Because it gives me escape <laughs> I sound like Mickey Mouse. <laughs> this, this, this got so dark. <laughs> Fuck. My favorite games are the maiden fuck games on white pussy. I never have memories of being on the It's a Small World ride as one of the animatronics. My kid's gonna be like, uh, what's his name? The one kid from um, the Boondocks after playing GTA. I like doing bad things. <laughs> my favorite game is the one where you got to put the gun in your my, mouth. <laughs> my, favorite, my favorite game is Epic Mickey. <laughs> wow, that's a shitty kid. <laughs> All right, absence of taste. Get out of here. Oh, God. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't become parents. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs>